it like this first weekend working with the staff? Uh, it was good. It was good to see those guys come out the way they did and, uh, you know, perform, uh, you know, a lot of expectations, obviously, all transfers, but uh, I think they all exceeded it. Uh, it was nice. Aaron, you've caught a lot of different pitches here now at OSC, especially, you know, with the new rotation coming in from different places. What, what was the feel like, you know, catching a game today with, with some of those different guys? Kimmy Madden wasn't here last year. Jesse Wayne Scott also wasn't here. What, what goes into that? Yeah, I mean, they're, they're really talented. Uh, they work really hard. Um, it's it's so nice to have guys that uh, you know really really like to work hard and you know are really bought into what we're trying to sell here and what we're trying to accomplish and uh, I mean it shows on the field I mean it's it, it's a breath of fresh air for me it's 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 fun to be back there catching them. As a catcher, you get the view of the entire field and you got to see some pretty great plays today. What did you think about that defense? Like, I mean Isaiah and Center, Luke at short. I mean Luke at second too. What did you think? Yeah, I mean they're 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 incredible players. Kind of what Timmy uh, touched on. I mean it's you know it's it's a team uh, it's a team effort, and uh, to have those guys, you know, you know if they don't make those plays, it's a it's a different ball game. So it's a uh, it's pretty cool to be back there. Pitching staff had 13 strikeouts tonight, and behind the play, what did you see from them that made them so successful? Uh, I mean, all of them were locating their off speeds really well. Um, you know, they they made my job pretty easy. Just you know, I was just back there. Just I mean, I was just sitting in a chair catching pretty much. So, you know, I mean, locating off speeds uh, for strikes was huge. Working with Wayne Scott in particular, obviously slider slider looked really good. Um, but when you're dealing with a guy like that that just has such palpable strikeout stuff, do you kind of do anything differently, or just let him? You just kind of say, hey, just throw it, and he's probably probably gonna put it past him. Do you have that kind of confidence in him? Yeah, I have confidence in all those guys. Uh, Wayne knows he's a he's a really good guy to have back there. Um, he has the right toughness for a for a back end type arm. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's a it's, it's good that he throws ninety five because you know you get to get past guys. But you know that that, that slider plays too. At the plate, how great was it to know that all you needed to do was get one run and the staff was going to take care of the rest? I mean, that wasn't the plan going into it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it was it was nice for them to pick us up that like that and. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was a great effort by everyone in the in the staff today. It seems like this weekend a lot of the new guys really shine uh, offensively. Some of the vets, you know, Ethan, you know, kind of slowly coming along here a little bit offensively. Are you worried about that in particular? What did you see from you guys, some of the returning guys at the plate? You know, at the beginning of the season, you know, some guys get out the gate hot, some guys don't. Um, good hitters will hit, so I'm not worried about it, you know. One through nine, you know, our nine here could be hitting one hole, our one hole could be nine, you know, it's, it's it's a pretty flexible lineup, and I'm not worried about it. Sam told us last week that he was going to call the majority of pitches with his background this weekend. Is that how it played out? And then he also said going forward he wants you to be calling a lot of the game. Is that something you take pride in and really enjoy? Yeah, it's good that uh, me and Sam are kind of that working relationship. Uh, you know, this weekend I called some, he called some. You know, it was kind of like a collective effort. And, uh, you know, I think that's how it's going to be going forward. And uh, it's nice that he has that confidence in me. Do you guys ever disagree on a pitch? Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean, we don't like argue about it, but you know, if I think yeah, he should throw this, like a curveball or something, and he thinks fastball, then you know, we'll talk about it. But you know, it's you know, it's uh, it's nice to have him to trust me, and you know, he'll listen, actually listen to what I have to think. So you know, it's nice. It's still early, but is there a different feel to this season in terms of ball club? Just not even on the field, just a group of guys. Right? You know, I, I mean, I love every guy in there. Uh, the clubhouse is, uh, I think that's the biggest part in having a good team. And I mean, I, I wouldn't I wouldn't trade any guy in there for any other team, any other player on any team. So, yeah, it's nice. What do you need to have your guy Joe back uh, to throw out that first pick and be here um, this weekend? Yeah, it was good to have him back. You know, I told him he should hit 90, hit 85. So he, uh, he undercut me on that one. But yeah, it was, it was good to have him back. <laughs>